Our meteorologist Michael White with your Fox 10 storm track report and we have southerly flow back out of the Gulf of Mexico and that's gradually increasing our moisture and slowly but surely making the air more humid and that's what's going to continue to make our mornings muggier and spark off the arrival of eventual showers and thunderstorms during the course of the day today as we pull as we pull back and show you what the severe weather risk zone is expected to be later this week on Thursday when we start to get a line of storms through here for now it's only a level one out of five which means severe weather still more of a possibility rather than a probability but that being said strong storms are going to be possible within the next couple of days of course the rain always a good thing but in the springtime you got to watch out for those powerful storms that can produce gusty straight line winds and hail weather headlines for your Tuesday patchy fog this morning and then throughout your Tuesday it's going to be pretty again. It's going to be dry with sun and clouds and then later this week showers return. But as you saw, the possibility of strong storms could blow through. So for today, sun and clouds, rain chances minimal to non-existent. Same thing for tomorrow. And then here comes the line of storms that we're monitoring. This is Wednesday night at midnight and then you'll see those things blowing through before dawn on Thursday. So for the first half of Thursday, things will be wet and stormy and then those storms move east of I-65 by midday Thursday and then late in the afternoon they're gone and your Thursday night and your Friday morning will be relatively quiet. So here is how the next seven days are going to stack up. We get the big chance of rain and storms coming in on Thursday. Additional chances coming in Friday and Saturday. Notice the air gets more humid with morning temperatures jumping to the mid 60s and then drier by Sunday and Monday of next week. Now we'll continue to update the forecast and talk more about your weather throughout the day right here on Fox 10 News Now.